Hi, this is Brian with figuregear.com and I wanted to show you guys a quick video demo of our new Firefly upgrade set. Uh, this is a set of 3D printed parts that are meant to bring the G.I. Joe Classified Series Firefly um, closer to that classic look from the 80s. Uh, these parts are hand painted and they're flexible. Uh, they're 3D printed with a flexible resin. They're durable. Um, they're painted with a dark gray and black mostly. I'll go over the paints I use later for the people who want to paint it themselves. Um, I always get asked what paints I use, so I just figure I can go ahead and include that in this video. The belt snaps in the rear, and then we have the two cross bandoliers. Um, we have a Desert Eagle with removable magazines. Bullets are painted. Um, so I want to show how to put the parts on the figure. Um, these are designed on a 3D scan of the figure, so they're, they fit very well. Um, just like the parts that come on the classified figures, these straps are pretty snug. So to, when you're first putting them on, just kind of slide them up with your fingernail. It's pretty tight right around this part. You can just keep working it up until it gets pretty close to that thigh cut. Just like that. And once they're on there, they're going to stay on there um, in place pretty well. They won't move around on you. Same with this one. There we go. The belt just snaps in the back so you can open that up. And it'll sit right around the belt line just like that. And then for these uh, bandoliers, what you want to do is just put his arms straight up the, in the air. You put on the uh, pouches bandolier first. Then the grenade bandolier. And then uh, I like to kind of adjust them to where they best kind of hide that butterfly joint because it's kind of ugly. But anyway, so there you go. That's how you get it all on the figure. Um, real quick, I'll go over the paints I've used. Um, for the dark gray, I used this um, Vallejo Model Air Dark Gray. For the black, I use Vallejo Game Air Black. Um, for his buckle, I used this Vallejo Model Metallic Air. And uh, I don't know if you can see in the video, but it's, it's got kind of like a, it's almost black metallic, like a really dark gray or gunmetal. And then for the bullets, I use a mixture of uh, brass, Vallejo model brass, and model metallic air steel. The brass, if you don't mix a little bit of steel with it, it comes out, it looks gold to me. Not kind of like what brass actually ends up looking like in the real world, so I use a mixture. And then we can just, actually I didn't put his Desert Eagle in his holster there. Yeah, I hope you guys like it. Um, you can buy this right now at figuregear.com. It's going to be available in hand-painted options, uh, DIY option, which is just the 3D prints as they come off the 3D printer. And you can buy the STL personal license if you want to print them yourself. Thanks, guys.